Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. I know it's been quite a while since my last video upload, but I am back and I plan on making more videos soon. But without further ado, let's get into today's video. Have you ever watched the movie Titanic and remember this scene? Did you ever wonder what those big tall gold thingamabobs were lined up inside of the bridge? Well folks, these are called Engine Ordered Telegraphs, or EOTs for short and were extensively used within the realm of maritime technology up until around 1950. Many people might think that these devices were directly connected to the ship's engines, and thus being how they changed a ship's speed, but actually, this device worked as an enunciator panel. On the telegraph itself were listings of various dial positions. For example, if the captain ordered the ship to go full ahead, then this meant that he wanted to maximize the speed of the ship to its fullest potential. This would mean that a sailor would have to walk up to the telegraph, push the handle forward to that position. By doing so, an alert would then go down to another telegraph placed in the engine room. The chief engineer would accept his request by moving his telegraph handle to full ahead, and after that, he would then alert the firemen and stokers to get to work. On early steam vessels, it was up to the hard work and dedication of the engine stokers, or black gang as it was commonly referred to as, to evenly distribute coal into the firebox for the ship to reach the requested optimum speed and efficiency. The same process would go for any other engine position the captain requested, so the engineers were truly the ones that had to be quick on their feet to accept the captain's order and to carry it out. You might think, hmm... This seems like a very inefficient process, and yes, it was, but at the time it was the best way of doing things. Warships during World War I and II also used the same method, which must have been very scary when getting fired at or approached by another enemy vessel. Just imagine, you spot an enemy torpedo boat behind you and you want to get away. The captain orders full ahead, the engine room receives that message, and as the crew try to push the engines harder, OH NO, THERE'S A TORPEDO! Atom shatter a world to fragments, or will it be a boon to mankind? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> but on another note, as of today, the traditional engine order telegraph has been replaced by a more modern system that is mainly used on nuclear vessels. And the majority of ships don't even need this system because they're more modern and advanced diesel engines. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick video and learned a little something from it. As always, thank you all for listening, like and sub, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.